H-U-H, did you thought you were gonna get away? No. Uh, you're practically, you used Etika's name for your own gain. And, and you might be saying, oh, aren't you doing that? No, I'm a small YouTube channel. This isn't gonna help me grow at all. This, I only got eight videos. I mean, eight views, which is, you know, I, I, I mean, that's still good, but that won't affect me negatively or positively. I gain nothing. The chance of of these series of videos saying I hate Kim so I'm talking about Etika blowing up are like 0% practically. I'm not gaining anything or I'm not losing anything. In fact, I may be losing actually if one of my 8 subscribers is a Keemstar fan and, describes the, and decides to unsubscribe. But I don't care. I'm still going to do it. But there sadly only will be four of these because there's only four weeks and two days in July. But um, maybe I'll continue it. But <coughs> I still hate you, Kim Star and H D H D. Just, just come on, make the video like I said last video. Just do it. Just do it. And why not? I'll even get Pyro Cynical to react to it and explain how much BS you put into it. It's going to be 100% BS. No reasoning on why you did it. No good or one at least. You're probably just going to make some BS up a lie or try to avoid it. And also, Ricky Burick. I mean, Kim Star, you have beef with Ricky Burick. How do you have beef with a cripple? And, you know, he jokes about it and, you know, other people joke about it. I'm pretty sure. And Ricky Burick, I think, is fine with people making fun of that. But but um, I'm just saying, how is, are you, Kim Star? How are you having beef or had beef with a cripple? That just shows that you just want attention.